Hey everybody, welcome back to more Kingdom Hearts. Hope you're having a good day. Uh, today, in this episode, we are going to get ready to head into the great beyond, the next world, Holobastion. First, we gotta talk to Sid. He's like, hey, let me see it. Alright, I'm gonna go do it then. Alright, bye bye. Now, just remember what Donald said to you. No frowning, no sad faces. How can you be so cheerful? There's still no sign of your king. Aren't you worried? I'm worried. The king told us to go out and find the key bearer, and we found you. So, as long as we stick together, it'll all work out okay. You just gotta believe in yourself, that's all. Just believe. I believe in you. Huh? What's the matter? Um, nothing. Kyrie, did you call me? You don't have a phone. Hey, how's it going? I did it. Yeehaw! That place is crawling with heartless. I remember all those years ago. I went up there and then all the heartless started pouring out of the castle. I was like, what in tarnation? <laughs> it was ridiculous. In case you're wondering, I just wanted to say what in tarnation. <laughs> I was like, I will do anything in my power to say it right now. Anything we can synth? That eh, doesn't look like it. Nothing new is what I mean. We can make stuff we've already had, though. Rather not waste the items on doubles. I think we should just head straight in. New world time. I like this is your this is your suggestion to go maybe pick up a couple of more items. I don't have the interest in it. We're going there. Let's warp to Neverland and get our route.
And onward to Hollow Bastion. Let's go! Faster! Nothing will stand in my way! Because I'll blow everything up so it doesn't hurt me. <laughs> Oh, we're heading into the void, all right. We almost hit that thing because it couldn't open fast enough. Why do Heartless have gummy ships? I think it's one of life's greatest questions. Well, we're here. New high score! And here it is. Hollow Bastion. Basically, the Heartless Headquarters. And basically, the one thing you want in any kind of game like this. A castle to explore. It's a big castle. It's imposing, threatening. It's everything I would want. Hmm. There's plenty of chests, too. Life, life gummy. Where do these take me? Transportation via bubbles. The hell? Hmm. Was there really nothing down there? Hmm. All right. The Hollow Bastion theme is probably one of the best tracks in the series. Used many a time. Really has a good for foreboding feel to it. Man, there really is nothing to do down there. And both bubbles took me to the same place. I guess they're there to show you kind of what bubbles will do. I actually forgot to add glide till just now. Like, oh yeah! the best movement in the game until we get an upgraded version of it. Blizzara ring. Alright. Is this the same thing? No! You gave me something. Uh, I was hoping you would not just leave me here. Eh, it's worth worth giving this a once over. There's plenty of stuff to explore in this world. No longer shackled by any Disney worlds, we can really up the level design and really make it look different and unique. No vessel, no help from the Heartless. So tell me. How'd you get here? Hmm. Uh, I simply believed. Nothing more to it. When our world fell into darkness, Bell was taken from me. I vowed I would find her again, no matter what the cost. I believed I would find her. So, here I am. She must be here. I will have her back! Take her if you can. Sick dodge!
So, you finally made it. About time. I've been waiting for you. We've always been rivals, haven't we? You've always pushed me, as I've always pushed you. Riku! But it all ends here. There can't be two Keyblade Masters. What are you talking about? Let the Keyblade choose. It's true, Master! Damn it! Maleficent My Keyblade looked cooler! You don't have what it takes to save Kyrie. It's up to me. Only the Keyblade Master can open the secret door and change the world. But that's impossible. How did this happen? I'm the one who fought my way here with the Keyblade! You were just the delivery boy. Sorry, your part's over now. Here, go play hero with this. King told us to follow the key and all, but... Hey, don't move! You're hurt! Why... Why did you... You come here? I came... To fight for Pearl. And though I am on my own, I will fight! I won't leave without her. That's why I'm here. Me too. I'm not gonna give up now. I came here to find someone very important to me. Well, uh... Things... things got worse. It's okay, we got Beast. Also, we do, like, no damage as a result of this. But thankfully, wooden swords and keyblades have similar magic powers to open any chest. <laughs> So we don't have to worry about that. So let's bust into this castle and give them a piece of our mind. Okay, that's not a... Uh, that's not great. I guess I'll head over here. Woo! We got bubbles! Oh, what do we have here? Yeah, but the enemies on the other side still counting. How dare they? There, go away. Damn it. Fuck you, beast. So these are dark balls. They're cool. I'm a fan. There's a bunch of little exploration and stuff you can do down here. Which I typically don't do. Just because it's kind of out of the way. This place is massive. Ah, right, that should be more than enough. Ooh. 
son of a bitch! <laughs> Piece of shit! Success, Guardian. All right, let's go this way. Need to get this chest. Hopefully, before any enemies come and ruin my life. Uh huh. Picked up trophy, treasure hunter. And you're able to save a screenshot of that one, weren't you? Square Enix. Square Enix isn't filled with a bunch of incompetence like Atlas. Or Bamco. Bamco is the same problem. With tails of. They got their stick up their ass like no screenshot! No video. Nine! <laughs> Alright, let's take the uh the correct way with this bubble. Get a fire ring. Deal with it, muscle. That's right. Another thing that I think is really cool is they're like, all right, we're going to have the princesses all here in Hollow Bastion. And let's bring over someone who wants to save their princess. So they give you Beast. They implement some of the Disney characters in a really cool way like this that I like. So all these buttons move these grates. So it's up to us to hit the right ones and hopefully get progress. I have encased myself! Never said I was the, uh... Never said I was good at this. Alright. I was wondering if we had to hit this one. Ah, yeah, and then you hit that one. And then that moves that one that encases us, but that means it's no longer blocking this, which means you hit this super button. Keep going, beast. You'll eventually do it. Eventually, you'll jump. Hey, jump. Jump. I don't know why I try with him. I hope you don't get your real body back. Well, we found a bubble. Okay. Now. Got ourselves a platform. Getting closer to figuring out how to unlock this place. Hello! Easiest way to take out defenders, which are these super heavy heartless. Just spam that gravity, man. Gravity is super broken on heavy enemies. Alright, now that we've hit that, the main gate to this place should be open. Let's get back. Oh yeah, but this encases us here. Damn it, all that does is that. Did I do this all in the wrong order again? I think I basically did, yeah. It's like you wouldn't think it, but the switch back here was needed. What? Thought I did that right. Have I been boozled myself? I think I have. What am I doing? Am I stupid? I think I am. Wait, no, no, that's right. And then I... 
There we go. I don't know. I don't know what happened there. Besides, you know, a bit of a mental breakdown. But uh, we're we're good. <laughs> hey, we're good. Yeah. We're, we're, what direction am I going again? No, we're, apparently we're not good because I'm still stupid. Oh, there's some stuff in this dungeon. This is a dungeon. Get out of here. Ah, uh, we gotta come back here for Trinity. We just gotta get Donald Duck and Goofy back. Those traitors. around those rocks. I right, listen, you bastards. Get out. Get out. I gotta leave. I don't know why I didn't just do the front gate there, but hey, everyone has to be special, right? Ow! Fuck it! Oh no, you've encased them in rocks! Close, I can feel it. Are you ready for them? <gasps> no. Why are you stupid? Quit while you can. No, not without Kyrie. The darkness will destroy you. You're wrong, and so will your skirt! The darkness may destroy my body, but it can't touch my heart. My heart will stay with my friends. It'll never die! Really? Well, we'll just see about that. Ah! Sora ain't gonna go anywhere. You'd betray your king? Not on your life. But I'm not gonna betray Sora either, cause he's become one of my best buddies after all we've been through together. See you later, Donald! Could you tell the king I'm really sorry? Hold on, Goofy! We'll tie him together! Well, you know, I belong in right for all. I guess you're stuck with us, Sora. Thanks a lot. Donald, Goofy. How will you fight without a weapon? I know now I don't need the Keyblade. I've got a better weapon. My heart! <laughs> Your heart? What good will that weak little thing do for you? Although my heart may be weak, it's not alone. It's grown with each new experience, and it's found a home with all the friends I've made. I've become part of their heart just as they've become a part of mine. And if they think of me now and then, if they don't forget me, then our hearts will be one. I don't need a weapon. My friends are my power. 
It's mine now! Get fucked. Fun fact, since like it, it, the twist that the Keyblade is meant to be Riku's it makes sense when you look at the design of the Keyblade. Where it's like the silver with the yellow motif. Completely matches his character's outfit. Of course, he decided to, you know, submit to the darkness at the beginning of the game, which pretty much made him lose out. So screw it. It's ours now. Let's kick his ass. But I found that little tidbit to be, you know, an interesting thing, where it's like, this isn't even supposed to be our adventure. It should have been his, but, you know, he made, he made mistakes. He got manipulated, but now he's wearing a skirt, so I'm gonna kick his ass! I'm gonna crush his fucking balls! Yours lost since you ran after one shadow. And the white trinity is unlocked. All trinities are available. Next up on our to-do list is... Progressing. We're gonna have to complete the Heartless Sigil to be able to... go through the main palace. So, detours, then. To the ancient library. It's not ancient. It's a nice library. Alright, picked up the comma book. Here on the K-shelf. And surprise, it's a puzzle. What a surprise. Puzzles exist in video games. There we go. We have a bunch of chests over here. Ultimug. I love Ultimug. Damn you! Pretty sure it's like RNG, you get the one you want. Listen to me! You will give me... I'm, I'm going to have a breakdown. breakdown, breakdown. I'm gonna have a breakdown! Okay, I was about to say it wasn't going to be worth it, but uh, sure enough, it actually was. Give me guard back. Hey, shelf. Did I pick up a book? Guess we can't put it in that one. There's plenty of shelves to put on books. Shelves to put on books. Let me put this shelf on this book. You know what I meant. I'm not gonna correct it. Maba. That. Give me a T is the button. Is the button. A uh, jackpot. This brings us on the second level of the entrance hall, where we have a bunch of little puzzles we have to do to get the pieces 
for the heartless door. Most of them are pretty self-explanatory. There's stuff like, light up all these candles. Damn you. Fire. There you go. And in case you're wondering, these, uh... Fire. These heads here will help you out. They will, uh... They'll give you bubbles so you will never run out of magic. And that fire puts out that fire. And really, a lot of these, uh... A lot of these puzzles are super easy. Just break these pots! Light these things. Do a trinity. And it's a good thing we didn't break that. And this one, I think we push this. And then the last thing we gotta do is go to this and shock it. All right, let's collect all these pieces. And this one that's all washed up. I hope it being wet doesn't ruin it. It's like, oh no, it's warped now. All right, let's open this sucker. mine know this the heart that is strong and true shall win the keyblade what you're saying my heart's weaker than his for that instant it was however you can become stronger you showed no fear in stepping through the door to darkness it held no terror for you Plunge deeper into the darkness, and your heart will grow even stronger. What should I do? It's really quite simple. Open yourself to the darkness. That is all. Let your heart, your being, become darkness itself. Well, he's on his way to getting a power-up. What well, one fun thing is it always puts you in this camera position, in that room after that scene. Very awkward, it can kind of turn you around a little bit. God, this is uh, quite an annoying room, just because you can get knocked down. best strategy is to take these wyvern heartless out with some uh, good old gravity. Oops, there we go. Eh, take me higher. Now we've got this very awkward transporter we're gonna board. And that'll take us to the other side of the castle. This entire place is really cool. It's just run by random light beam things. And, and then you got... Oh, I never even noticed that. Like, half the Heartless Sigil's broken down and you see it's like clockwork and gears and there's that Heartless box up there which- Oh! That's what that is! That's like a platform later on. I guess that that's- they're trying to show it to you to scale because we're gonna climb up further and have to mess with that. Or we might not have to. 
Because I do know a trick to avoiding that section. Which will only do... Which will basically just save time. Here, the Black Mage, Heartless, extremely annoying just because they have a lightning attack that makes them invincible. To apparently everything but magic. Man, if I had known. If I had known! I'm just used to, like, going, oh, I can't attack him. Alright, so this will take us to the, the right side. Get, get even closer. Hmm. Well, while we're doing this, we should probably, uh, give my dude some better, uh, items. They're much better. Mega Potions, Mega Ethers, and one Mega Elixir. I'll allow myself the one. Cottage! Cottage and, uh, and a Mega Elixir. Okay, good. Well, I feel less bad about using it now. And a Thundaga Gummy. Onwards to the lift stop, a pretty common place over here. A large network of transporters. I have to say, this castle is very convoluted. Okay. Pick up this chest that you usually miss. It's got an oriculcum. Why did I have to say it like that? Oriculcum. Okay. So, one way that you can skip a lot of stuff I've seen in videos is through the use of Dumbo! Let's see if I can do it right. From what, from what I've seen, I get right here, dismiss, and then damn it. <laughs> uh, I, I watched a speedrun once recently and saw, saw the dude just skip that completely by doing that. I kind of wish I could have, I could have managed that. Now, now I'm just disappointed. What, you tell me I can't do it now? You tell, you tell, you're gonna cut me off from doing it? No, I'm gonna do it. We're gonna sit here for 10,000 years. And I will do it. I will show the fruits of my labor. See ya. Get right up, get right up in this grill. Get r Hold on, get right up there. Fuck you! Do you know what just occurred? Ah, we did it. I did a cut because I kept fucking up. Somehow, even though I wasted two minutes doing that entire ordeal, I saved more time than I would clearing all these enemies, going around two rooms and doing the other side. So, I see the path has emerged at last. Yes, the keyhole to the darkness. Unlock it, and the Heartless will overrun this world. What do I care? The darkness holds no power over me. Rather, I will use its power to rule all worlds. Such confidence. Oh. That's some hot shit you got there. Uh, impossible. The princesses of heart are all here. It must be her. Without her heart, she will never be able to release her power. The king's fools are here. I'll deal with them myself. You stay here and guard the princesses. Go. It's time for an encounter with the uh, 
The woman that's been giving us a lot of grief. Her and her cohorts. Let's do this. I'm afraid you're too late. Any moment now, the final keyhole will be unsealed. This world will be plunged into darkness. It is unstoppable. We'll stop it. After coming this far, there's no way we're gonna let that happen. You poor, simple fools. You think you can defeat me? Me, the mistress of all evil! Alright, so this is the Maleficent boss fight. It's pretty, pretty simple, to be honest. She's basically a stationary object that you must beat on. But she has a floating rock, so that is something you got to be wary of. Actually, she isn't always stationary. Sometimes she'll uh, turn into a magic glyphy thing. Oh no, her rock! Whatever will I gravity? Gravity will instantly take out the rock, so... It's a good way to immediately get back in and start layering on your damage. It's, it's really cool that KH1, even though they do it in a later game, the KH1 has you fight Maleficent, but you don't actually play out the events of her Disney movie. How dare you! I made it. Oh, damn it. I was feeling really good about that. Get down. We're done. And that was, uh, pretty simple. Let's make sure we get the double tap. Do you need some help? Riku! A slack? Yes, a Keyblade. But unlike yours... This Keyblade holds the power to unlock people's hearts. Allow me to demonstrate. Behold! Oh! Now, open your heart. Surrender it to the darkness. Become darkness itself! This is it! This power! <laughs> darkness! The true darkness! And here comes notoriously one of the most difficult bosses in the main game. Dragon Maleficent. But it has one quirk that I learned quite recently about it. It's true weakness. It's stop! I never knew this! You could just... You could just... Blur Run stop on the bitch! And it lets you just layer on damage. Did not know that. That's, that's hilarious. However, we can't let that make us suddenly play bad. We need to we need to play responsibly. And bust out Tinkerbell. Tinkerbell casts regen on us while it's around, and if we die, it sacrifices itself to bring us back for free. Makes it super useful against some of these big, annoying bosses. 
If we had a better form of stomp, this would make you so much more useful. This is also the first boss to have four health bars, so good lord. Its tankiness is very clear. I actually meant to do Aurora there. What's funny is, I believe it was in a strategy guide for this game. Basically said, alright, the key to winning this, if you're really bad, is to go near some of the roots on the side of the arena and let Donald and Goofy just beat on Maleficent until it's over. Which I find to be a funny, a funny band-aid to win this fight. I think it might have even been like the official guide. I remember hearing it from somewhere that was official, kinda. Not a big fan of all the green fire that's just everywhere. Oh god, here we go. Yeah, whatever, at least we're getting checkpoints. Okay, Tink's still alive. I had to kind of look there for a second, like, did she die in that whole thing? No, we're good. Oh, good. You want to fucking slobber on another round of this shit. Fuck it, thunder! Got it! She was just another puppet after all. What? The Heartless were using Maleficent from the beginning. She failed to notice the darkness in her heart eating away at her. A fitting end for such a fool. And I picked up Fire Glow. Oh, that was a fun fight. Kinda. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Alright, I'm gonna want to change my customized menu here. I want Aurora on... I want access to it in my shortcuts. girl has lost her heart. She cannot wake up. What? You! You're not Riku! The keyhole cannot be completed, so long as the last princess of heart still sleeps. The princess? Kairi's a princess? Yes. And without her power, the keyhole will remain incomplete. It is time she awakened. Whoever you are, let Riku go! Give him back his heart! 
But first, you must give the princess back her heart. What? Don't you see yet? The princess's heart is responding. It has been there all along. Kyrie's heart rests within you. Kyrie. Kyrie's inside me? <laughs> I know all. How did I forget about that line? Tell me, who are you? It is I, Ansem, the Seeker of Darkness. Well, you tried. So, I shall release you now, Princess. Complete the keyhole with your power. Open the door. Lead me into everlasting darkness. And now it's the real fight against Riku. The one that most people remember because it's hard, it, it is a uh, is uh, not new new player friendly your first time. And if you die back in the original, you can skip cutscenes, which made this even an even bigger problem. At least I'm getting some text. Ah, crap. He's charging up. Fuck it. Going all in. Alright, I'm completely ruining him. I'm deflecting all of your shit. Alright, here's his desperation move. Here we go. Get a double tech off that? That was nice. Open your heart to darkness. Oh, here we go again. Alright, come on. Oh, this again. What? Hey, we did it! We totally did fuck up! <laughs> Whatever, everyone has their moments. And Ragnarok. It's pretty good skill. Riku! Swearing! Swearing! What? Oh, the keyhole! that unlocks people's hearts. I wonder. Sora? Sora! Hold on!
Kimura? Are you really? No, he can't be. I won't let him go! So, you have awakened at last, princess. The keyhole is now complete. You have served your purpose, but now it's over. Do you think we can stop him all by ourselves? I don't know. Impossible. No. You won't use me for this. Riku! You've got to run. The Harless are coming. Fucking Donald Duck. What about the keyhole? Let's get out of here. Wow. We're heartless. I was like, hey, how's it going? Well, let's leave. <laughs> nice place we got here. We got... It's heartless friendly, and... I wish we had, like, a button that let us, you know... Use our, like, dive into the ground move. Well, fuck me. I can't go this way. That's fine. I was about to go like shit. Did me did me sequence breaking make it so I can't actually proceed? No, there's plenty of ways to go. Look at that, we're down here now. There's another cliff. Oh look, we're we're here. We gotta go into that gate. I can't make it! I tried. Oh, thank God they take denizens of darkness. Do, do, do. It makes sense the Heartless wouldn't pop out at this point, you know? It's like, uh, hey, I'm just a normal man. Just a normal dark man. That's racist. Now, yeah, there's a Heartless after you. Oh, man, Donald Duck will take care of him. <laughs> Sora? Is that you? Yeah, what's up? I'll protect you. Sora! I'm back! That was surprisingly simple! Thank you. without Bell. Now go! The Heartless are coming. All right. Let's get out of here. Tell me what happened. So I got on Dumbo the Elephant like four or five times and failed to get onto that platform. So the darkness is flowing out of that keyhole. Uh, yeah, that too. No wonder there are more and more heartless everywhere. The only way to stop them is... Seal the keyhole, right? Maybe, but no one knows what will happen once it's sealed. 
Well, we can't just stay here. We have to do something. I've got a friend back there. That's right. You have one more friend to worry about. Riku's Keyblade must have been born of the captive princess's hearts. Just like that keyhole you saw. Of course, without Kairi's heart, it remained incomplete. Once that Keyblade was destroyed, the princess's hearts should have been freed. Don't worry, Sora. If anyone can save your friend, you can. Well, we're back. Everything seems to be fine. How you doing? Not good. It's good to know. Good to know. She's really good on that uptake, you know? <laughs> it's no problem for her. I always forget there's a lady in the tramp thing there. Oh no, all the heartless are good here now. Now that we've done Hollow Bastion, every world can now compete at a much stronger level. I'll check uh, our synth menu, much to my own disappointment. Get ready to end off this video. This is good. This is a long one. Yeah, nothing, nothing new just yet. Anyway, I'm gonna end off here. We're gonna head back into the fray of Hollow Bastion in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time. <laughs>